Hello, hello, hello. So when we look at what is the most important information, that's probably the most important thing that we can do is what is the most important thing? So the most important thing in my humble mind boils down to five realities. The first reality is the awareness. This is very important. Both Kabbalah and science say this. It's very hard for us to understand it because we see with our senses, but our senses are we're in a video game. So imagine a character in a video game says, you know, you ask him, what's the world? He says, oh, I see a sky, I see a tree. Says, yeah, but somebody made that world. This world is continuously being generated by God. And so we are within basically God. There's nothing but God. And that's a very important premise because it changes everything else. If it's a video game and there's nothing but God, then the next question is, why did God make it? And the answer to that question is because he loves you. You know, there are only really two motivations to do anything, and that's love or fear. And love is an expression of self, and fear is a protection of self. Well, God can, doesn't have any need to protect himself, but he does have a desire to express himself. And we are, it's like, why do you have a child? Because you just love your child. We are that love that Hashem has, and he made the world. And then, of course, he wants the best for us. So what does he do, just like any healthy parent would do, gives the child, first of all, a physical world, all the good things, but also he gives them freedom of choice. He gives them a mind, he gives them a yetzatayv, a good side, a bad side, and then the child has to begin to discern what is true, what is real, what is not. Ultimately, the parent also gives the child information. God gave us the Torah. If a person is seeking the truth, there's a hundred percent the truth is here. And as our as the previous Rebbe said, the truth comes to those who seek it.